Hey everyone, in today's video, I wanna show you how to get Adobe Premiere Pro for free with a free trial, and it'll unlock the entire app, and it'll even give you Premiere Rush, which is the mobile version of Adobe Premiere Pro, again, for seven days for free at the time of this recording. If you click the link below this video, it will bring you to this page where you could simply click free trial, but let me show you some of the benefits and some of the pricing options here once you get to this page. So Adobe Premiere Pro is definitely the leading standard in video editing, and Premiere Rush is a mobile version of that. And I have a tutorial to both of those if you're new to them, so I'll include those in the description below this video. So once you get the free trial, you could learn from that quick tutorial to see how to get around those apps. And as you can see, there's 100 gig of cloud storage included. And this is always updating, so make sure you check out the latest version when you click that link. And as you could see, this is for individuals and this is the pricing. So you do get seven days for free at the time of this recording. Then you have to pay the monthly fee here. And then there's a business version and there's a student version to us a little bit cheaper here. And the difference between these two options that you get here, one is Premiere Pro, which is just the editing app and Premiere Rush, which is included with it. But this has a bunch of other apps like Photoshop, Audition, After Effects. So if you're really using this for beyond one app, if you're using this for two or more apps, this is a better option. This is the option that I have. But once you press start free trial here, it's gonna give you a layout that this is a seven day free trial and you could cancel anytime. So if you don't like the app after you take it for a free trial or you don't think you're gonna use it, make sure you cancel so you don't get charged. And then for the seven days, it's completely free, no watermarks, and it's the exact version that I'm using right now to edit this video. And then you could choose between the annual plan or pay monthly. It's a little bit more when you pay monthly as an individual, but if you're a student, it's a little bit cheaper. And it's that simple to get started with Adobe Premiere Pro. Again, check out the tutorial for Adobe Premiere Pro so you get used to it. I also have tutorials on Photoshop and other Adobe products too that you could check out on this channel to learn all those apps and what they have to offer. I hope you found this useful. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for easy to follow tech videos and I'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching.